On web, when you fill up a form and submit, the JavaScript provides you a way to read those form data. You can read the form data using the form data object and calling the get method on top of it by passing the name of the field for which you want to get the value of. So for example, when I typed username password into that login screen, I could get the username and password value by using the form data dot get, passing the username and the password as these were the name of those fields respectively. And then I can use that username and password to do anything that I want. For example, call an API and perform the login. However, imagine a case when you are dealing with a form with many fields. For example, this registration form, when you fill and submit, if you now have to get the value of each of those fields, it is too much to type. If you have eight fields, are you going to do form data dot get for all those eight fields to extract the values that user have typed? No. And you have a great workaround here. The JavaScript's form data object is a key value pair. And in JavaScript, you have a method called object dot form entries which can create a JavaScript object from a key value pair. So instead of typing so much, you can simply do object dot form entries and pass the form data object. This is going to create a plain JavaScript object with all the key and values that corresponds to the fields in your form. Then you can use JavaScript destructuring to get the value of each of those fields and use them as you need them. Let me know with a comment if this was useful to you and you would like to get more such short tips from me. If so, give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and check out my JavaScript React and Next series. See you soon.